Hello everyone, my name is Sonex and welcome back to Factorio. As you can see, last time we automated a lot already, but we have here a huge backline now on copper plates. One way to fix it is to put a box here with a fast inserter like this and then another inserter. That might be actually a really great plan. Yeah, I'm going to do it like that. Um, for this. But first we're going to get some coal. And meanwhile we're going to make a lot of plates. 20, 30. Grab some more coal. So, but for this to work, we need uh, coal to also go that way. So, we need a splitter. So, splitter, oh, where are you, splitter? Ah, here you are. Two. Four, five. Uh, I think we have enough belts at this point. Let's finish those. Because I need my splitters now. Okay, that's the first splitter. So I'm thinking to to that one here. Or actually this would maybe work better here. Uh, I'm just trying to figure out what's the best way to do this. How am I on height? I could actually go up more. Like this. Yeah. Mm. We don't need those now. And what we do need is some belts here now. So what the splitter does, it effectively uh, splits this uh, for 50-50%. So if you have here another, so like this is like 100% of our coal and it goes pretty much to our energy consumption here. If you split it, you get 50% on this line, 50% on that line. And if you build like another splitter, then like if you build here another one, Like this, we, we essentially have here now 25% and 25% of the main line, or 50% if you compare to this one. So, but I don't need a splitter here. That's a nice thing to show you. Okay. That's far enough for now. So, I want to automate these as well. So what I can do is 
continue this line. I'm going to change this one, right? Yeah. Uh, let's remove that one for now. Because we need the electric one here. Do I still have electric ones? No. Let's make a bunch. So we need electric one for the stone. If we go like this, it should be more than enough. Now we need a small electric pole. For now we put a box here. So we need a to in the ground ones. Maybe one in the ground is, uh, gives two, I don't know, actually. So uh, if you build these boxes here, it will, they will fill the boxes. Uh, on the ground, in the ground, ah, uh, here. Yeah. Don't need those at the moment. Uh, it's too short like this. It works, but if I'm happy with it, I don't know yet. So, where do I need to go? Well, I need to, I want to connect to this line. So, Like this. This one can go. So now we have 50% of our, our coal, which goes this way. And it goes through the tunnel. Well, it should go, yeah. And then it should join the line here. And once it back locks, it should be fine. There's quite a big back lock at the moment here though. And those can handle it fine. Okay. You know what that means. We can put some more of these. Uh, we need an insertus. This is for your OCD that we match it up again. here. Let's make uh, some insurers meanwhile. We need them anyway. Then we need the electric poles again. Uh, 
Uh, this one is complaining about Kuma. Oh, this these don't have power yet. Uh, it should be fixed now. And it's also picking up the coal now. So essentially we have now automated our iron plate production. Because we bring in coal on the line, we bring in a lot of iron. Um, but I'm not happy how this line really runs here. Because what I want to do is... Actually it doesn't matter for me here. Only if I want to do something more with the stone. Later on uh, it will matter. Yeah. So what I was talking about last time is I want uh, transportation belt like this. Oh. This one can go. Because it's time to uh, automate our science uh, more. So what we do is go like here, then we need underground like this. And then we can meet them up. And that's long enough for now. How many? Oh, we still have plenty, but we can only have like 15 a slot. Yeah. So, um, yeah, this doesn't have to go that far. This is far enough. So now we need our assembly machines. But first I want to check how our power is doing. Consumption is in yellow, so we need some more power. But I was kind of prepared for it. Because I had stuff laying around already. Uh, boilers. Three boilers. And we want two underground pipes. Two steam engines. Oh, we have a bit too many. Yeah, it's covering a bit the copper here. But at the moment we're not really using it. Okay, so it's connected now to our power network. Um, but this ne will need coal too, so we extend this one. What we can do is like this, I hope. I need three burner inserters. One, two, three. I hope they fit. Yeah, it seems they do. And this is so fine because we can just walk through because we built our pipes here. So that's good. So now let's check our power now. It's green again, so that's perfect. Oh yeah, I think I should reduce my pulse a bit. This one was unnecessary. Same for that one. Because the more poles you have, the more energy you consume. If I'm right. Uh, actually, not considering to this. Okay. It's actually good to know. So, the assembly machines. 
For this we need iron gear and copper plates. So we need the iron gear. Uh, actually, meanwhile, let's make some more assembly machines. Like five, uh, ten. We need a lot of them. And then we need some inserters here. We'll put these iron plates back on this line. Yeah, I have here now like a half storage with these boxes. Uh, infantry full, okay. This is a bit uh, my storage for my infantry here. Or my supply depot or however you want to call it. Uh, where are your boxes? Oh, it's still building machines. Yeah. So by um, let's move it a lot. By shift click, by just clicking, you can drag it and put it in. By shift clicking, you can put like a stack, and by control clicking, you can put all of the same kinds in it. I think that's always good to know. Yeah, this is completely stacked now, so we need to work hard on this. Um, uh, control. I like to be a bit organized. So this is all the iron. Oh, all the stone. Perfect. So we have here an assembly machine. And think we should be fine if we build it here. Let's see. We need to get. Do we need to go to make those? I need to check this. Uh, to make, I just need plates and an insert. Okay. I have an idea. I always have ideas. Let's just put them here. Three, four. And these were all going to make iron gears. No, this fucks up my core line. Mm, yeah. So how can we do this nicely? Another way would be just to do it in the north here. Actually, I think that might be much better. So we space it out more. So we move all the iron out of way. So we just extend this one. Make a corner. So, what looks for me? Three, four first. And we grab the inserters. Like this, and then some electric poles. And so we can put them in the middle. Perfect. 
And now I need to change the direction of this. Yeah, that's the thing with this game. You think you have a plan and then you change your plan again. Because you come up with a better plan. Oh, I haven't assigned these yet. <coughs> so now they're working. So that's perfect. How's my iron production? It's quite good, huh? Plenty of iron plates. Yeah, I need to uh, now transportation one here. And uh, we can put this. So once the gears are done, we can put them on. So now we have our iron gear production. Um, I don't have enough copper. Oh, I don't have copper already. Don't worry. Now I have copper. Yeah, just make the one. Maybe I can sort it again. And it needs power. So we just do this. So this one is now filling uh, iron gears. Rather quickly, I think. Yeah, it's fine. So what we can do, actually, since iron is coming on this and on this one, we can have another pair of four of these and we put them on this side. We need more inserters. And then we're going to make even more iron gears here. We just set up another line, pretty much. Uh, you have to go, unfortunately. And I need another box. Like that. Now we need power. And that's powered. So that's enough. And then we need to change this. So now this line of seven. Oh, that one has eight. Yeah, that's not fair, huh? That's well a stone service. Extra one here. And I need 
one in certain and So these don't have coal, and the reason is the iron ore is completely blocked, blocking all the coal access here. I hope this will help for now. The main issue is that I'm building iron on both lines, so it's double blocking it. At least that's what I think. So let's now put this back. How fast are you? Oh, this one doesn't have inserted to the line. That's an issue. Um, so now it's matches soup, electric pulse. How fast are you producing? Let's give this one some extra. I'm go just gonna give some a bit of extra iron ore. I might need to have a smarter way of this. I thought this would work better than it actually does. The main issue are these. I have an idea. I can fix it. Oh, uh, just the cost. A few more transportation belts. That's wrong direction. Okay, and now Let me connect the electric pulse again. Ah, uh, we don't have enough. Oh, actually we can do it. So, no, this doesn't solve the problem, because it's still on the inside. And I wanted to get it to the outside. Then there's only... One other way. Or I need to change these. There's another way. And then we need this again. Oh, wait, we need those. So instead, we now it should be on the outside. Okay, so that's what we gotta do. And 
crack sleep. There's one more change. I know it works, but we can do it like this. The reason I show you in a second. Actually, there are two reasons. When I was building it here, I had overlap from these, from both months. So that's not efficient. And now, I think we can be a lot more efficient with our electric poles. Because we can build them in the middle. So I don't need these anymore. I think we're saving electric poles now, since we have it now set up like this. And now all the iron ore is coming on the outside. So what we just have to do is clear this backlog a bit by manually picking it up and just putting it in the machine. Uh, And now we have the coal on the one side and the iron ore on the other side. And now it should work as uh, how I want it. Uh, yeah, one problem here. I didn't assign a job for them. So they were recently Essentially doing nothing. Uh, I don't need that one anymore. No, it's far enough. Actually, like this, since that's the last inserter. So these are not doing anything. Yeah, they need iron plates. Don't they have it? Is our power fine? Yeah. I'm not using you anymore, so let's just get rid of you right away, and you too. I'm gonna make a similar machine for this, actually what I could do is this. And I see the problem already. Let's just re put them. They were aligned the wrong way. Now it should work. Let's try it. So we got iron plates getting on here. We got here a small buffer. If my iron ore has a good production line, 
and it seems rather stable and the call should never get in the outside lane there I think I can do the pulse a bit more efficient, but apparently I can't. Okay, that one is empty. This one is not doing anything. So this one and this one are not doing anything. How is it here? That one is working hard. Those three are being lazy. I need more iron on the plate. Uh, there are two ways. Now I should have some more. Okay, now the other is working, that one is working. Oh, the last one isn't working yet. Because there is not enough iron. There is a way to solve it, probably. It means more iron production. Iron plate production. But this is doing fine. So this is now the overview of our little base. I think we're doing quite well. Oh, you're doing fine, you're doing fine. Can we move you? I optimized our electric network a little. We have a little new design here. And this way it will iron ore will always be on the outside. So of course stays on the inside. And we have here two double fast inserters. And the box is purely for um, buffer. And both boxes are full, aren't they? Yeah, they are. Actually, we can do uh, one more thing. There's always one more thing to do in this game. <laughs> That's so true. Um, box here. Box. So. I had so, uh, quite some iron plates in my inventory, I just put them in here and now the line will be filled up a bit more. But I don't like this way because it's now uh, manually filling it up. So the thing what I would like to do still is, let's work here, make a new little screenshot. So I'm still thinking of uh, where to put the screenshots because I don't use Instagram or anything but I would like to share them. Maybe there's on the website of Factorious 
place for city journals. So I can put them there. So this is our uh, yeah, gear, automatic gear cons construction. I think we have plenty of gears now. And uh, yeah, next time we can continue further our red science production. Um, because we need oh, just copper plates and iron gear. Yeah. Okay, we can do a lot of red science next time then. We just built some assembly machines for red science, then some labs behind it. And we just connect this copper, loop it up on the ground here. Yeah, that's for next time. So, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. It's a bit of a long episode again. I want to see if I can into uh, shorten it a little but there's so much to do still so i don't know how yet but i will try my best thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it and i see you in the next one stay determined and goodbye